Good morning, babies, and welcome to Simply Stacy, where the joy of the Lord is our strength. Well, babies, today is Monday, and I want to tell you today that we need to push reset. You know how your computer, sometimes you got to reboot it because it's acting up. It's got so much stuff downloaded on it. You know, you got to just put stuff in the trash. In our lives, in our mindset, sometimes we need to push reset to be able to move forward. There's some things that may have happened in the previous months. You know, we're almost halfway through this year. I still sit up and think, oh, my God, it'll soon be Christmas again. It seemed like Christmas just left. But, baby, sometimes we need to push reset. You may be feeling overwhelmed at this moment because of different situations and things going on in your life. But, babies, push reset. As God said, get your mind renewed. Get your mind renewed. You know, sometimes you just need to be refreshed and renewed. You know, the hustle and bustle of your day, your week. You're doing this. You're from one this, from this project to that project, from this situation to the next situation. Babies, push reset today. Get reset. You know, sometimes doors not opening for you and things not working out the way that you plan. You know, the word said, many are the plans of man. <laughs> and don't we have some plans you know we write them down we want them to happen when they don't happen when we want them to happen you know we're frustrated we're asking god why why me why is this happening why i'm on this road why i'm on this path why did this happen to me why me well sometimes you know people say why not you but we still question sometimes why things are happening to us but babies push reset don't worry about why this happened push reset and say, from this moment, I'm going to start afresh. You know, I done done that with some things in my life right now. I had pushed reset. You know, a fresh new way of doing things. You know, sometimes you just got to approach a situation different to get a different outcome. Babies, closed doors and things not working out the way that you want them to work out can be your best friend sometimes. Because God may have a plan that's far greater than what you have already planned for your own life. And maybe you need just to sit down and write the vision and make it plain. Like the word says, write your vision, make it plain. Do you know exactly what you want to do? Do you have a plan on how to get to where you need to get? You know, and make sure it's God's plan now, not just your plan. Make sure he, you have consulted with him. He has given you direction. Write it down and make it plain. God will download to you what you need to do if you just ask him. Babies, push reset today. Reset. Reset the things in your life. Reset your mind. Reset your spirit. You know, reset your mouth. You know, the things we speak in our mouth, we are creating in our life. Everything that you speak out of your mouth. Let your actions line up with your mouth. If your mouth was speaking the right things. <laughs> Babies, I love you and so does God. I just want to tell you today, push reset. Reboot your life. Reboot your thoughts. Reboot your spirit. Just push reset. Babies, I love you and so does God. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Have a wonderful, wonderful week. Just begin to just see things anew. See things afresh. And, you know, you may have to work all this week, but your day off, you know, just go somewhere and be in a quiet place with God and reset, reset, find a time and a moment where you can sit down and reflect and try to approach things in a different way. Because I just feel it in my spirit. God will just give me in my spirit that so many of you guys are frustrated. You're frustrated right now because things have not worked out in your life the way you wanted to. You know, you had plans and seemed like doors has been closed, but God, he has a plan. Find God's plan for your life and it'll work out for you. Babies, I love you. Have a wonderful, wonderful day. Smooches, sugar woogers.